a new open source AI model just launched that's beating Claude Opus and GPT-4 on major coding benchmarks, and it's up to five times cheaper. It's called Kimi K2 from Moonshot AI. Today, I'm going to show you how to take this incredible new model, connect it to your local environment, make it insanely fast and cost effective using Open Router, and then use it with a powerful framework called Super Claude to perform a professional grade analysis on a complex AI agent project. So how do we get our hands on this? While Kimai has its own platform, the best and most flexible way is through a platform called Open Router. If you're not familiar with it, Open Router is a unified interface for over 400 different LLMs. It automatically routes your request to the best available providers for any given model, balancing cost, speed, and uptime. And you can see here on their leaderboards, Kimi K2 is already the 10th most used model on the entire platform. Now let's talk about the most important part, the price. Here on the Kimi K2 model page, you can see the cost is just 60 cents per million input tokens and 2.50 for output. Compared to Claude Sonnet 4 at $3 for input and F59 for output and GPT 4.1 at $2 for input and A dollar for output, this makes Kimi K2 drastically more cost effective for large, complex tasks. The magic of Open Router is that it gives you access to multiple providers running the same model by default. It load balances requests based on price and uptime. We can even sort these providers by throughput and see that Grok is by far the fastest option available. To get started, you just need an account. I've already added $5 in credits here, which is more than enough to follow along. Then you'll head over to the API key section, create a new key and copy it. That's all we need from the website. Now that we have our open rotor key, we need a way to connect it to our local coding environment. We'll use this fantastic open source tool, Claude Code Router. This tool acts as a middleman, intercepting requests from Claude Code and sending them to any model provider you want including open router. Installation is just one command, npm install. If you're new to Claude Code itself, check out my previous videos for a full setup guide. The first time you run start, it will prompt you to configure your first provider. We'll enter open router for the name, paste in the API key, use the standard open router API endpoint, and set the model name to Moonshot Hive Kimi K2. Our local server is now running and listening. In a new terminal, we'll run this launches Claude code connected directly to our local router. The API base URL is pointing to our local server. We are now ready to code with Kimi K2. Okay, we have the model and the connection. For a real project, we need structure. This is where another incredible open source project, SuperClaude, comes in. It's a framework that brings a professional software development lifecycle directly into Claude code. SuperClaude adds specialized commands for development and analysis and it uses smart personas to make the AI think like an architect, a security expert, or a refactorer. It also integrates with MCP servers like Context7 for documentation, Sequential for complex reasoning, and Magic for UI generation. The recommended way to install it is with a super fast Python package manager. We'll clone the repo, change into the directory, and run of sync for our demo. We're going to analyze this full stack land graph agent. 
It's a complex project with a front end, a back end, and multiple moving parts. I have a full video on it if you want a deep dive. After cloning the project, we'll launch our Kimi powered Claude code session. We'll use the superclaude command, analyze, give it the path to our project, and add the flag to enable the sequential thinking MCP server. This helps the AI break down the complex analysis step by step. We've hit an error. The error indicates no endpoints found that support cache control. This is a provider specific issue. The fix is to open our Claude code router config file and add a simple transformer block to our open router provider. Let's restart the router and try again. And look at that. It's completed a comprehensive analysis of the entire code base. We have a full architecture review, code quality analysis, security analysis, and a performance profile with actionable recommendations. This is the power of the full stack SuperCloud provided that the professional framework, Kimi K2, provided the powerful agentic reasoning and open rotor delivered it at incredible speed and low cost. So to recap, we combined three powerful open source tools to create a professional AI development workflow. Kimi K2 for the model, open router for flexible access and super Claude for structured analysis. This is how you level up from simply prompting an AI to truly engineering with one. If this guide helped you, please hit that like button and subscribe for more advanced AI engineering tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.